What happens when the crown jewel of modern warfare, a $1.7 trillion masterpiece, faces the possibility of being sidelined? Imagine a fighter jet designed to dominate the skies, suddenly at risk of losing its throne. Not because it's flawed, but because the future of warfare demands something even more advanced. The F-35 Lightning II, America's fifth-generation stealth fighter, has been hailed as a technological marvel, but recent comments from the Secretary of the Air Force suggest its role might be evolving. As newer technologies emerge, the Air Force appears ready to adapt, even if it means curtailing its once unwavering commitment to the F-35. Today, we unravel the layers of this unfolding story. From the F-35's revolutionary origins to the pressures reshaping its destiny, and finally, to the cutting-edge technologies vying to redefine air combat in the 21st century. In the 1990s, the U.S. military set out to design a fighter jet that could do it all. Stealth to evade radar, versatility for multiple mission types, interoperability across branches like the Air Force, Navy, and Marine Corps. This vision materialized as the F-35, developed by Lockheed Martin through the Joint Strike Fighter Program. The goal was to create a platform capable of replacing aging fleets like the F-16, A-10, and AV-8B Harrier while integrating cutting-edge technology. The F-35's defining feature is its stealth-reduced radar cross-section. Its design makes it nearly invisible to enemy radars. Advanced Sensors The Distributed Aperture System, or DAS, gives pilots a 360-degree view, detecting threats before they even appear on radar. Networked Warfare The F-35 isn't just a plane, it's a data hub, sharing real-time information with other assets in the battlefield. With over 900 units delivered to the U.S. and allied nations like the U.K., Japan, and Israel, the F-35 became a cornerstone of Western military air power. Its variants, like the F-35A for the Air Force F-35B for short takeoff and vertical landing, and F-35C for carrier operations, offered unparalleled versatility. But while the F-35 soared in capability, it stumbled in cost and complexity. The F-35 program's lifetime cost is estimated at $1.7 trillion, making it the most expensive weapon system in history. Critics argue that high maintenance costs are a significant issue. The jet requires intensive upkeep, with an average flight hour costing around $36,000. Software delays are another concern. Upgrades, such as the Block 4 modernization, have faced repeated delays, impacting its ability to stay ahead of emerging threats. Additionally, parts shortages have slowed production and impacted readiness. Despite its capabilities, the F-35 has faced criticism in some areas. Reliability is a major concern, with only about 55% of F-35s being mission-capable at any given time, falling short of readiness targets. Payload limitations are also an issue. While its internal weapon bays preserve stealth, they limit how much the jet can carry compared to non-stealth aircraft. The global landscape of aerial warfare is evolving rapidly. China's J-20, the Chengdu J-20 stealth fighter is closing the technological gap, with advanced sensors and weaponry rivaling the F-35. Russia's Su-57, while lagging in stealth, excels in maneuverability and electronic warfare. Drones and hypersonics are also becoming significant factors, as adversaries invest in unmanned systems and hypersonic missiles, reshaping the battlefield. These developments highlight the need for next-generation solutions that go beyond traditional fighter jets. In December 2024, Secretary of the Air Force Frank Kendall hinted at a potential pivot, curtailing the F-35 program. While not abandoning the jet, the Air Force may reduce future orders in favor of investing in new technologies. Next Generation Air Dominance, or NGAD the NGAD program aims to develop a sixth-generation fighter with advanced stealth, AI integration, and modular design. Collaborative Combat Aircraft, or CCA, manned-unmanned teaming could redefine air combat, with autonomous drones supporting piloted fighters. The NGAD platform is shrouded in secrecy, but promises capabilities far beyond the F-35. Artificial Intelligence, 
assists pilots with decision-making and threat assessment, enhanced stealth, further reduces radar and thermal signatures, modularity, easily upgradable systems to adapt to future threats. The CCA initiative focuses on developing autonomous drones to complement manned fighters, roles, reconnaissance, electronic warfare, and precision strikes. Cost efficiency. Drones are cheaper and expendable, reducing risk to human pilots. Force multiplication. A single fighter could control multiple drones, creating a networked battlefield advantage. Hypersonic missiles capable of striking targets at speeds exceeding Mach 5. Directed energy weapons, lasers for neutralizing incoming threats like missiles and drones. These technologies align with the Air Force's vision for a more flexible, high-tech force. In the short term, the F-35 remains absolutely vital for current operations, especially in contested environments. However, reducing F-35 purchases could free up funds for the development of NGAD and CCA, offering strategic flexibility for future needs. Allied Forces Nations like the United Kingdom, Japan, and Australia rely on the F-35. A reduction in U.S. orders could impact production costs and timelines. Competitor Reactions China and Russia may accelerate their own programs, potentially intensifying the arms race. The Air Force is likely to adopt a balanced strategy. Use the F-35 for roles where stealth and versatility are critical. Deploy NGAD and CCAs for high-intensity, peer-level conflicts. The F-35 represents a turning point in military aviation, but the next chapter will be defined by adaptability, speed, and technological integration. The race isn't just to build the best jet, it's to build the best system of systems. The F-35 was designed to dominate the skies, and for now it remains an essential part of America's air power. But the demands of modern warfare are evolving, and the Air Force is preparing for what comes next. Whether it's NGAD, autonomous drones, or hypersonic weapons, the future promises to be faster, smarter, and more connected. What do you think about the Air Force's shift in strategy? Is it the right move, or should the F-35 remain the centerpiece of U.S. air dominance? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. If you could design the next great fighter jet, what features would you prioritize? Share your ideas and join the discussion about the future of aerial warfare.